Hello and welcome to the Late Game Show. I am your host Chuck that Estes. Today, presenting to the Late Game Show is the martial art scene. There will be three different setups using Phoenix Strike with a shield, two claws, and one with Cobra Strike. With the first setup using a Black Oak Shield, I have 6.5k fire damage, 11k lightning damage, and 3k cold damage. Using 60% increased attack speed, we reach the maximum frame possible. But do keep in mind the build can still be improved by using 3 martial art gloves with twin increased attack speed and plus 1 to all skills corruption on the bar checks and set of 3 sockets. Since the revamp of martial arts, the skill has kind of went under the radar and is extremely strong, if not S plus tier. For the first run using a shield, you can see the gear on screen, I completed the map in 11 minutes. Which for this setup, the clear speed is incredible, the safety is top notch with 75% chance of block, a lot of attack rating, high enough vitality to feel comfortable in almost any situation. <coughs> with very small gear change, you can do Obers and D clone. Even without all the GG corrupts, the build is still very good, thanks to the 3 elemental damage types, infinity is not really a necessity. You have amazing AoE and crowd control. As for the dual claw setup, using a second bar trick with 2 lightning and 1 cold face set, we drop the clear speed from 11 to 10 minutes. So definitely a significant damage increase at the cost of about 20% chance to block and gaining the ability to block while running. So take it or leave it. Otherwise, the Cobra Strike Assassin did compete fairly well with Phoenix Strike. In that regard of speed, with Dual Claws, I did complete the map in 10 minutes as well. But I did encounter another problem. Without the ability to freeze enemies with Phoenix Strike, your HP pool become akin to a ping pong ball. So if you decide to go with Cobra Strike, I highly suggest running a Storm Chill or risk getting one shotted by about anything. And so to conclude this insane build, the pros are as follows. Incredible clear speed, great survivability with a decent HP pool and block chance, a lot of attack rating, can clear almost all game content, not too expensive if you disregard the GG corrupts and infinity, 3 elemental damage means about nothing can survive you, great area of effect damage and amazing crowd control while using Phoenix Strike. As for the negatives, I would say Phoenix Strike kind of outshines all the other elemental or martial arts, Fist of Fire, Claws of Thunder and Blades of Ice. The second negative would be that don't forget you are still squishy. If you run into M damage and R charge, your HP pool can go completely invisible and trust me that is not a great thing. And what would I change to the tree? I would increase the area of effect of every single element martial arts. Grand single element martial arts natural peers. Make Blade of Ice third hit be a frozen orb. Make the third hit of Fist of Fire combustion. As for Claws of Thunder, I believe the natural pierce will be quite enough. And with that, you have a very late game martial arts scene showcase. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you are not already, and join my Discord in the description down below. Thank you all for watching and stay safe. Until next time, bye bye.